Hello everyone and welcome back to the Waterstones vlog. My name is Lee and today I have prepared a book review for you. Now this week has been a particularly spooky week with Halloween just behind us. Stranger Things is back on the TV, the clocks have gone back, so we are getting into the time, this run up to Christmas, where things are a little bit weird. And for those of you who like this time of year where things are a little bit weird and a little bit wonderful, I have the perfect book for you. The book I am reviewing today is It Devours by Joseph Fink and Jeffrey Craner. Now for those of you familiar with those names, they are the creators of the Welcome to Night Vale podcast and they wrote the first Welcome to Night Vale novel and this one, It Devours, is the second in the series. Though the two books aren't linked, they are both set in the weird and wonderful town of Night Vale. And for those of you who aren't familiar with Welcome to Night Vale, it is a science fiction podcast which is set in the weird and wonderful town of Night Vale and a highly recommend you go and check it out if you haven't already listened to it. But we're not here to talk about the podcast today, we're here to talk about the novel and oh my god, this is a great novel. So let me tell you a little about the book. For those living in Night Vale, they are very aware that a lot of strange things happen within their town. None more so than Nyland Jana, who is a scientist. While Nyland Jana is working away at her studies, Carlos, the scientist, sets her a mission. The house of Larry Leroy has disappeared into the void and Carlos wants Nyland Jana to find out why. But the mission is dangerous because the city council and former mayor have warned Carlos to stop his experiments. But ever in the pursuit of science, Carlos and Nile and Jana can't help themselves and go off to find out what is happening. And then slowly, all around Night Vale, places just start to disappear into the void, leaving behind a gaping hole where they used to be. Now, I'm not going to go too in depth with this for you because if you love Night Vale as much as I do, I really, really want you to read it because it is a most excellent book. If you are familiar with Welcome to Night Vale, you will already know a lot of the cast members inside of this, including Cecil, Carlos, Dana, Pamela Winchell, John Peters, you know, the farmer, and Steve Carlsberg. But the main plot follows Nile and Jana, and it's so nice to get a new character to follow. And the book makes a lot of references to the podcast as well, with things that have happened in the town previously. So if you are familiar with Welcome to Night Vale, this book is absolutely perfect for you. It's also great for those of you not familiar with Welcome to Night Vale, because it is a great starting place to start off if you're going to go and listen to the podcast because you'll already be familiar with some of the characters within the story. Now, Joseph Fink and Jeffrey Craner are both wonderful writers. The book is phenomenally written. The way it explains things is just wonderful. And as I was reading the book, I was actually reading it in the voice of Cecil Baldwin, who is the voice of Welcome to Night Vale, because I think that's the way it's written, that's the way it's set, and it just flows so well. And the story as a whole is really well done. It has lots of twists and turns, things that you just weren't expecting, which I definitely wasn't. And it takes you on this journey of trying to find out why some of the strange things that happen in Night Vale happen. Do we always get the answers that we want? No. But do we get the answers that we need? Yes. Again, a lot of the characters in the book have come from the podcast, so they're already very well established, um, but the new characters that it brings in, it does a great job of introducing them well. It gives you great detail of who they are, their beliefs, what they like to do in their spare time, if they are scientists or not, and it is really, really wonderful to get hold of these new characters. The book is really funny throughout as well. Again, harking back to the podcast, some of the things that it just brings up casually into the book is just brilliant, and the way the whole book is set out is just perfect. So if you are a fan of science fiction, or you like the weird and wonderful, or you're just looking for something new, I highly recommend It Devours by Joseph Fink and Jeffrey Craner to add to your collection, uh, because it is just great. I'm so happy that this book didn't disappoint. It is wonderful and brilliant and yeah, I can't rate it highly enough. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. But before I go, I'm going to leave you with a quick proverb from the town of Night Vale. Today's proverb. Look to the sky. You won't find answers there, but you will certainly see what everybody is screaming about.